This week on Nonstock, there's a four driving in Geraldton. Here we are at the start of the track. We're just gonna air down a bit. I'm gonna go down to 19, because I don't like sand, and I know it's gonna be soft out there. We're just gonna drop down to 19 and see how we go. If I have to go lower, I'll go lower, but you know, it's the first time, probably the only time you'll ever see me lower the tire pressure. June of the day. Hope I make it. I don't want to. I don't want to get bogged halfway up the hill. You know that won't be very good. going to go down this thing called a, a Razorback. Yeah. Already watched Danny go down. Danielle, our competition winner. And now they're going to get me to go down. Whoa! Holy shit! Okay, this is the biggest sand dune I've ever seen in my life. I didn't bring my Dubai LS1 powered patrol. Yeah. 
Just gotta slow it down. Interesting whoopsies, little whoops, left and right and up and down and all over the joint. Making my gut turn. Oh, the front wheel's in the air. Alright, hang on, hang on. Just wait, I'll get out and film. Hold it. We had to stop here, didn't we? <laughs> So far, I haven't really explained where we are and where we're going. So we're um, we're in Geraldton, and this is the 
the Drummond's the Horrix track, I believe. Yeah, it's just the sand so far. It's been a bit sketchy here and there. Nothing, nothing challenging, just Trish is a little bit temperament when it comes to angles, you would say. Like that. Hang on. There we go. Other than that, it's been pretty nice. It's a nice, it's a nice day for it, I guess. I'll, I'll, I'll shut up now. You can now. Uh, yeah. bit of an update from the camp of Trish it's stinking hot right now I would turn the aircon on but I don't want to lose any huspers holy jeez <laughs> Okay, so now we're just about halfway, under halfway to, to the Horrix. We're um, weaving through the sand and that. Uh, can't really film at the moment. I'll throw the drone up. I'd say it's a bit too windy for that. And uh, we're just gonna, just gonna keep moving for a bit. Um, Cause we're, we're gonna run out of daylight. Yeah, so that's where we're at so far. And uh, see what happens later on. Holy.
So we're just coming into Coronation. Right now, actually, right at the moment, we're driving through a dry creek bed. That's a, that's a WA thing. I'm from Queensland. We've got water that runs through these holes in the ground. But um, dodging a few trees. Those hill climbs back there were good fun. One was scary, you know. I didn't make it all the way up. But, you know, she was all good. So um, we'll just keep poking along for about Three hours into this track, we're only about halfway, so. I don't like this low shit. I don't know if I'm gonna have a, have a tent on the roof by the time I, I get to here. Keep going straight up the hill. What hill's that? Well, we just went up. I'm still in the creek bed. Are you? Yeah. No, this is where you go, Ed, isn't it? Oh, you're going through here. I don't have any idea where you're going. Oh. He, I don't think we do either. <laughs> Sorry, I'm right back there and went up the hill. No, 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 no. Where are you going? You're back. now going the wrong way. You guys want to turn around and come back? Okay, where's back? Where are you? I'm lost.
so we've come to the end of the four wheel driving for today. We're going to set up camp in a minute. Danielle, our uh, contest winner, she's going to be heading back back into town because that's it for her for tonight. She's not going to be camping. We got Jordan here, who's making a <laughs> making a mess at the campsite already. It looks like we've been here, so when we pack up tomorrow, we're going to have to take those cans with us if if we take them. All right, so we're going to set up camp and yeah, it's going to be good. Fully stocked. Every night I'm going on the grid, texting back. I want you, hit you up. I'm on the other side. I miss you, miss you. Take you off. I came your way to strong. Cannot keep it low key. Got me drugged, your pheromones hit the roof Bottle, your taste It's really a bad reception out there Where you heading? Why ain't gravity pulling you in closer to me? I've lost you But I need you And you're off my radar now Hello ladies and gentlemen, Jordan again from uh, Fully Stock, <laughs> just here cooking tonight, uh, we're um, going to cook up some uh, chips and some teriyaki chicken, hope no one dies, let's see how this goes, so at the moment when you know we'll just uh, chuck this tray on like that, a little bit of this uh, green uh, say kerosene, We'll, we'll use that. Like this, yeah. No, don't worry if it starts flames, you know, that just has the flavour. Spray that on there. Let's get some chips on, eh? Kerosene chips are the best. Right, better throw some more on because they've got two little puppy dogs here and they're a bit hungry too. Yeah, we better throw some more on. Now you guys better sit back and wait because it's going to take like, I don't know, four hours to cook these chips. Good thing it's only like two o'clock in the afternoon in WA. Alrighty, -oh, let's check these chips out, eh? Fuck it, we're only camping, this will do. Get these suckers out of here, eh? Let's see what the dogs reckon. Let's see what the dogs reckon. Here you go. Here you go. Try this. Here you go. Try this. Nah, apparently the methanol oil is no good, but anyway, we'll move on. So now we've got to cook some chicken, teriyaki chicken. Never done this before, guys. Let's let's just wing it, eh? Bit like driving a patrol, full driving, you know. I've never done that, but fucked out. I drive a cruiser. I make it everywhere. All right. Apparently, That means it's cooked. Pull that bud. Don't pull that. There we go. Teriyaki chicken. Whose idea was this teriyaki chicken? I might work out all right actually, this is pretty cool. Right. So if you go back a few episodes ago, we tried the, um, what do you call it, the lasagna? Let's just hope this turns out a little bit better. Right. 
There we go. Just squeeze it. You've got to squeeze every inch out of it. Like, oh. like that. Oh, Jesus. Oh, whoa. This guy happened in here. Ooh, teriyaki chicken. Now, you guys are missing out. Like, seriously, all you watchers need to hurry up and get out here of the Amazon in the middle of New Zealand because we're cooking up a dirty feed. And you're all missing out. Well, it's not New Zealand. Oh, sorry, New South Wales. That's right, Amazon and New South Wales. These guys just don't know where they are. Like, we're, we're seriously, we're trying to work it out. Oh, look at that, boy. Some teriyaki chicken that we're going to destroy. Let's just throw that in there like that. And I suppose we'll wait for fucking five minutes for it to cook, and then we'll just eat it. Send it, eh? Just like that. Right here, guys. Let's uh, let's see how this Tucker turned out, eh? Um, teriyaki chicken and chips. Um, well, I don't know how I cook tonight, but let's just see how it goes. Um, I reckon I'll just serve it up, and I'll get our uh, main man Wade to come over and uh, taste test today. Let's see how it goes. Oh, we got. Oh, yeah, we got some chips happening there. I'll turn this off. Oh, we've got some. Dirty chicken. Oh yeah, look at this. Teriyaki chicken boy. I don't know if you can see. I don't know how well you can see, but that there looks like the bomb. Oh yeah. So let's get this cranking, eh? Let's go. Oh. I don't know about you guys, but I'll give you like no chicken and um, I'll give you heaps of chips and I'll have all the chicken. So, as soon as we've got it on video, I just want to take no recognition. If anyone dies, it's not my cooking. Honest to God. There's Pania. I hope there's no fussy people here tonight. Wade, how fussy are you? Not fussy at all. <laughs> That's what I need of you. You better come over here and taste test some of this. Oh, yeah. Get into it. You tried it yet? It hasn't killed you? No, no, I've definitely, I've definitely tried it. Definitely tried sure. it. All right. Looks like shit, mate. Hopefully it tastes <laughs> like shit. Let's <laughs> give it a whirl. Mmm. Nah, it tastes like shit. Tastes like shit? Nah, nah, nah That means good. you'll survive the night. Nah, it's You're good. done alright. You're good. done alright. I'm right. taking this over to the fire. Alright, I, I think his sweetheart, um, um, what do you call her? Um, anyway, wait, sweetheart, come over here and have a taste test. Please come over here. Jeez, everyone, don't look. She's coming. Don't. She's coming. <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, I reckon this is, I reckon this is dirty. To the fork? Oh yeah, I'll have a taste this too. I suppose I better eat it on camera too. Yeah. Oh, that chicken's good. <laughs> that chicken's fucking really fantastic. Good. Well done. Yeah. 
No, no, good, good choice of food, to our guys. Yeah, mm. yeah. All right, guys, I'm checking off. If you don't hear from me in the morning, you know we're dead. Or just too hungover. Mm. Cheers. All right, so we packed up camp. Um, took took five ten minutes. We didn't even have breakfast. We just wanted to hit the tracks again. So now we're on our on our way. We just passed the halfway point, Oryx. I believe that's the name. I always tend to fuck all the names up. That's just a given. And um, we'll see how this section of the track goes. The first section yesterday was actually pretty good. Plenty of spots where I didn't even bother trying to go because you know I actually still have to drive this truck 10 hours back to Kalgoorlie when we're finished here. So I don't want to break anything. Even though I've got the spare parts, it's not worth breaking anything. So uh, we'll keep going along this track and we'll see, we'll pull up at the interesting parts. Oh, on today's episode guys, we're uh, just going to follow this track, see where it ends up and hopefully might end up somewhere they call Horrocks. Copy Jordan. Yeah, got a copy rubber ducky. How's that piece of shit cruiser going this morning? Mate, this piece of shit cruiser is probably going better than your piece of shit cruiser. Yeah, mine's going pretty good. Where, where, where are we heading? Well, I'm sort of hoping we might end up at Horrocks. Just depends whether you can keep up or not. Oh, don't worry. This cruiser will keep up, no worries. Maybe the poor old puppy dog follow and we'll see how he goes. So this hill I'm about to attempt, I'm not too sure on it. She's uh, pretty steep, but it's all good. I've got a cruise, there's no point backing out. I'll just fucking hold it flat. See how we go. Wish me luck, guys. quite what I wanted, but I'll give it another go. Ladies and gents, he made it. Jump on the back. Uh, yeah.
winched out up top of here, mate. I just hit a bank and couldn't go any further. Just hold it there, mate. I'll unhook it. Alright, so we've just reached the end of the, the track and the beach has just washed away over like erosion and shit. Uh, how was the trip Jordan? What do you reckon? Fantastic. You kept up with me, I'm proud. Yeah, mo most places. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's it for this one. We're going to turn around and just take off. Uh, head back along the track that we come along. It'll be about three, four hours. It'll be quicker because we won't be stopping to film it. So, uh, thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. See you later. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we just made it to far northern Queensland. Wasn't, wasn't such a bad trip, you know. Uh, 48 litre, 48 tanks of fuel, about 2,500 litres. Uh, you know, not much. 47,000 beers on the way. Time to turn around and go back because I need more beers. Peace out. Hope you have a good day.